Uh, anyways, let's... <gasps> were beautiful. No, I'm so Future. It's my Whatever. My regular Niffler. Hello beautiful people, how's it going? I'm back with another video. Today I wanted to do an unboxing of an exclusive Geek Gear box that I got for no apparent reason. Just so you guys know, I'm not actually subscribed to Geek Gear at all, but my sister was kind enough to buy me one of the boxes. I actually don't know what's inside here, but I'm really excited to find out. Apparently she handpicked the items, but I've always thought about subscribing to Geek Gear, so if I like the stuff that's in here, I'm probably gonna do so, and then begin making videos for you guys. I am so excited to see what's in here and I'm so excited to actually get to finally unbox this. Without further ado, let's begin! Oh wow. This looks like a lot of shirts, which is really good for me. If you guys haven't already noticed, I've worn like five different shirts for like the 47 videos that I've done on my channel. Yeah, it looks like a lot of shirts. This should be really good. Okay. So this is the first one, it's black, and the front... Oh! Okay, so what size is this? Oh, it's a medium. It's a medium. Okay, so it's two wands. Whose wands are those? It's a basic black Harry Potter t-shirt, but what's really cool about it is that I actually don't have a t-shirt in this design. So this is actually really great. I really like this one. Shirt number two. This is an interesting color. <laughs> I, I don't think I own a shirt in this color. I can see that it's a logo from the sun, but I'm not actually sure what it is. Oh, that's nice! It's a Secret Keeper shirt! For a second I thought it was going to be an Order of the Phoenix shirt, but no! This is a lot more low-key. As you guys know, I actually prefer low-key Harry Potter shirts. I don't really like shirts that are just blatantly Harry Potter in your face. So this is absolutely gorgeous. I really like this one. So props to Geek Gear. I think these are all designed exclusively by Geek Gear, so I think... I think that's one of the reasons I really wanted to subscribe because they have stuff that you can only get at Geek Gear, which I think is pretty cool. Okay, so this is t-shirt number three in a grayish blue color, which uh, is really cool because I have a lot of grayish blues. Ah! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay, so this is a Snape shirt, and as you guys know, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a fan of Severus. I'm a fan of Severus, you guys. I love Severus Snape. Fight me. Oh my god. Oh my god. You guys. You guys. She knows me so well. Okay, so so on the actual shirt, we get to see a stag, which uh, we know is Snape's Patronus, with the quote always written in yellow. Again, this is a low-key Harry Potter shirt. Like, only real Harry Potter fans would understand this reference if they see me walking in the street with it on. That's what I like the most. I mean, I don't like blatant Harry Potter shirts, and this... This is just so beautiful. Oh, this is my favorite so far. I love this so much. Okay, so by the color, I actually think I know what this shirt is. Because I actually think I saw it in one of the previous Geek Gear unboxing videos. Let's... Yep, I was right. <laughs> okay, so this is... Oh, it's actually, it's so nice! Again, see, another Harry Potter reference that's not too Harry potter -y. These are the kind of shirts that I adore. It's just, it's, it's Harry Potter, but also it's not too Harry Potter. So it says, it's going to be a bumpy ride. Uh, I just tried to imitate that guy from the night bus, but never mind. It's really creative, and the colors make it look so positive and happy, and... Is that? Oh, it's supposed to be the moon! Get it? Because werewolves in Harry Potter. I love it. It's gorgeous. It's gorgeous. How many t-shirts are in here? Oh, wow. Okay. T-shirt number... Five. Okay. Okay, so this is, this is again, another t-shirt that's subliminal Harry Potter. Again, you guys know how much I love these. And I think if I'm not... Uh, yes, it's all of the seven, all of them? Yeah, Harry's in there too. It's all of the seven Horcruxes. I actually really like this design. Nagini just goes all the way. Oh, this is definitely my favorite so far. This is definitely my favorite shirt so far. I really like this. This is definitely my favorite so far. It's so gorgeous. And here is the last shirt. Okay, so this is a light blue, which I really like, I guess. And the front is... <gasps> you guys, it's me! It's me! It's the Niffler! It's me! Guys, literally. Oh my god, I have no shirts with the Niffler on it. And it says... Every day I'm Nifflin! Like, every day I'm shuffling. Get it? Like the song. Okay. Well, best for last, right? The Niffler, in my opinion, or the way I see it, it's, it's from that scene in the bank where the Niffler has got, like, the coins stuck in his... 
pouch? I don't know. This is actually, this is, this is definitely my favorite. These are gorgeous. Finally, finally have shirts for my videos and what is this? Certificate of Authenticity. This World of Wizardry exclusive art print has been hand signed by artist Paul Tonner and is guaranteed to be authentic. Guys, uh, I didn't, I didn't see this one. I first opened the box. Okay, well this is a printed hand drawing uh, of Severus Snape. And it says, S is for Snape, right? Oh, and Snape's wand is on the side and it says always. I really like this. Now I have to find a place to hang it, but I want to open this up and see. It's not even paper, it's a piece of card. I love this. This is, this is some quality. This is a quality item, and yeah, it's hand-signed by the guy who painted it, which I think is really cool. But yeah, this is fantastic. This is phenomenal. Wow, I am so appreciative. This is amazing. And there you have it, guys. That was my unboxing of a surprise Geek Gear box. If you enjoyed the video, please leave me a like and a comment down below, and subscribe to my channel to see a lot more Harry Potter content. Bye, guys!